so this this new phenomenon recently called sort of girl boss feminism. Mm. Now, what what is that? Because I, you know, what was it? Boss ass bitch feminism. Now, I think I might be on board with that because you know, I mean, my wife's a bitch. <laughs> Anyway, these cart these sort of disgusting cartoons. What's it called? Disgusting cartoons. Vulgar, vulgar drawings. Cartoons. Vulgar drawings. Vulgar without the R because it rhymes with vulva. Because a lot of it's about all that stuff, isn't it? All that stuff. Uh, you're sex positive, mm. which is no longer a death sentence. Antivirals for that now. What is sex positivity to you? Having sex with lots of people and trying new things and like going to sex raves. Do you go to sex raves? What's the what's the what's the etiquette with um? Do you just do you just leave your spouse outside? Say I'll just be fuck. I'll be twenty minutes. People go with their partners because they're open. Oh come on. They're open relationships. What, what do you, how do you how do you look at each other afterwards? If you look at each other drawing. Oh God, no. what's my wife meant to think looking at me, drenched in another man's cum? It's a new world now, isn't it? With um. There's no we're sort of getting rid of slut shaming as a society. Yeah, I like uh, sleeping with people on the first date mm -hmm. because if they don't like me for that, then it's like a good way of culling them. So you've reclaimed the word slut. Yeah, wear it with a as, with pride. No, it's a good thing. It's definitely a good thing. It's just that progress always leaves some people behind, doesn't it? You know, like for example, my dad and I like the only real way we would bond when I was a kid was on a Saturday when we'd go out and shame the local sluts. You sell these big brown bags, like called cooking tomatoes. They're like sort of little squishy, little squishy things. They're not, you know, you wouldn't use them in a salad, use them in a sauce or something. Anyway, big bag, like ninety p a bag, and we just go out there and just fucking start pelting them. You know, fucking filthy nuns, da, ah. dirty nuns, ah. the nuns. Yeah, they're, they're, they're the worst, man. Because they try and tell you they're not, but they fucking are. Da, da, filthy nuns. Can we get some of her drawings up first? Uh, What's this vampire guy? Who's, what is he? he looks like a fun guy. That's about uh, weaponized incompetence. People that drain your energy. Right. Because you do all the, house, all the domestic labor and then they act like they don't know how to do it so that you have to do it for them. Like washing, cleaning, going to the shop. Well, they say, don't they, that there's that old, I mean, it's not, not, not a nice joke, but there's that thing about why, why are women's feet smaller so they can get closer to the sink. But, I mean, it doesn't make any sense, you know. I mean, my wife, she's got hooves. Sorry, it's not PC. You'd probably call them trotters now, wouldn't you? But the, the point, what's the point of this again? That everyone uses their body to earn money and being on OnlyFans isn't, isn't different to that. Some people wank to people eating food or like sloshing. Do you know what that is? Word grief, what's that? That's having sex with cakes oh, and desserts, like jelly and whipped cream. Japanese thing, is it? They, I think they do anything over there, man. Ten, yeah, tentacle porn. That's a Japanese oh, thing. On. I watch that. Really? Mm. <clears throat> What's going on there? It's a, uh, it's like an octopus with like eight Fuck phallic uh, things that like yeah, yeah, yeah. go in someone's mouth and oh, vulva and. Good lord! What's the what website there? Uh, Lo-fi is like XNXX. I do have smaller squids as well. <laughs> That's tadpoles. An any anthropod. There's a video online of a man having sex with a horse, you know. Now, how do you get hold of that? <laughs> Part of the reason I invited you on is that I'm, I guess you'd call a failed cartoonist, really. That's, that's what I wanted to do. I spent years of my life all on this one. I was so convinced it was going to work. Pumped everything into making an animated version of the Quran. Sent it to the publishers and they're like, where's the fucking main character? I can't fucking draw him. Did you publish it anyway? Huh? Do you get quite a lot of um, trolling? Yeah, I yeah. get uh, messages from trolls and incels. You've done quite a lot of research on it, right? You did yeah, it. I pretended to be one. Pretended to be a 14 year old boy and just like assimilated with them and watched all the horrible stuff they were saying about women. Did you, were you insulting women as well to sort of fit in? I'd sort of like, observe and kind of comment, but never start my own thread. 
I don't want to yeah. like, encourage someone. Well, it's a bit of you when you're doing it and you're like, she's a fucking fat whore. You're like, oh, yeah, this feels fun. I was thinking of doing my own cartoons for like new dads because I just had a baby. Yeah. So like this is... That's nice. This is like, this is me like falling asleep with a little milk bottle there, falling asleep, you know, and then um, then just kind of get, get a bit older and I'm hiding in the car because I just can't deal with it, you know, and the wife's in there. And then uh, you get a bit older. Now, listen... Man's got to have release, you know. Family life's stressful. You got to. The, the moral of that cartoon is you got to. You have a home study. You fucking lock it. And your daughter's walking in. I don't know. What, the thing is, I don't. I didn't know which way. Is it better to face the door when she comes in, <laughs> <laughs> or is it better that you? You know, I don't know which is better. Well, I think I thought it's better that way because then she can't fucking see me. You did the one pay, one pay post. Yeah, uh, for Field, the uh, dating app. Right, and what's going on there? It's like a kink, sex positive dating app. So yeah. with other apps like Hinge, you would put your interests like films or travel. Yeah. And um, but with Field, you put like I'm a dom, I'm a sub, I like bondage, I like um, ropes. Yeah. yeah. See, I've always thought this. I thought that because on like the dating apps I used to use, it was just like the height of. It's like that's, that's not enough info. I need more measurements. You know, surface area. Horsepower, momentum through the air, talk. You know, I'm, I'm all for romance, but I've got a fucking business to run. There's a thing called like big queens, which I learned from Field, which big is like queens. women who like men <laughs> with big dicks. Women who like men with big dicks. Yeah, and big I thought queens. that was like all women, but it's like a subculture. Of so I need to look for small queens. <laughs>